Welcome to the Sure Word for Today audio and video devotion. The Sure Word for Today is the abundance of the free favor of God. In this series, titled The Strength in Sharing, from our theme Embracing Vulnerability, The Strength in Sharing, we focus on the importance of opening up, particularly when facing mental health struggles. It is easy to feel isolated, but people cannot help if they do not know what you are going through. Sharing your burdens, especially in times of difficulty, invites others to support and uplift you. Through this seven-part series, we will encourage and guide you to take that brave step out of fear and into healing. You will discover how opening up can break the chains of shame, bring light into the darkest moments, and offer healing through connection. We will talk about the strength found in weakness, the healing power of being heard, and the process of rebuilding after moments of brokenness. Remember, you do not have to carry your burden alone. Lean on someone today and let them help lighten your load. Mental health conditions are often hidden unseen struggles that many face. I recall my former boss, an accomplished executive with a medical doctor husband, living the seemingly perfect life, yet she secretly battled nephomania, an uncontrollable sexual compulsion. Unaware of the condition, she turned to fate to suppress her urges but remained bound by a mental health disorder she didn't recognize. In another case, I saw a movie where a young girl was nearly killed by a mob for stealing something trivial. It wasn't about the theft. She suffered from kleptomania, a mental health condition that drove her actions. People around us, our colleagues, friends, and even family may be silently battling these hidden struggles. It's time we shed light on these conditions and offer understanding, compassion, and hope. In my new playlist and series, mental health conditions on the YouTube channel, The Sure Word for Today. I will shed light on conditions like this, which often go unnoticed. People may appear fine on the outside, but beneath the surface, they carry severe mental health struggles. In this series, we aim to educate, empower, and raise awareness about these often misunderstood conditions. You will learn about disorders like nephomania, kleptomania, bipolar disorder, complex post-traumatic stress disorder, and others that have no medical cure but can be managed with understanding, support, and faith. We believe that with the power of God's word, healing is possible. Whether you or a loved one is struggling with a hidden mental health condition, there is hope and restoration in Christ. Subscribe to our channel and our daily devotions to stay informed and inspired. Links are provided below. Be part of this journey to spread awareness and compassion. The Table of Contents We include the Table of Contents to help you navigate the video easily, locate specific sections, and enhance your overall viewing experience. We start with the affirmation. Begin your week with a powerful affirmation that sets a positive tone for the days ahead. These carefully crafted affirmations enhance self-awareness, overcome doubts, and foster self-love. By embracing these statements, you align with your goals and values, nurturing a more profound sense of self-worth and compassion towards others. The affirmation resonates with our theme for the week. The title for today's devotion. The title highlights the overarching theme of our weekly series, providing insight into the topic we will explore in depth throughout the week. The subtitle for today's devotion. The subtitle reflects our approach to presenting weekly topics through seven daily episodes, each corresponding to a specific day. It guides you in understanding how we break down and deliver the central theme over the week. The Key Bible Verse. Discover the guiding light for the entire series through the key Bible verse. Rooted in scripture, this verse serves as a beacon of wisdom and inspiration, anchoring your faith journey. 
The sure word for today's devotion. Delve into the heart of the devotion, where insights are shared and spiritual guidance offered. This core message forms the foundation of inspiration, ministry, and fellowship, nurturing your soul and deepening your connection with God. Connect. Our Connect section bridges scripture with real-life situations, making the message relatable and applicable to your daily life. Extend. In this section, we encourage you to meditate and explore additional perspectives, scripture references, and historical context to enrich your understanding of the central theme. Reflection and Application Here, you will reflect on the content and consider practical ways to apply the teachings in your daily life, fostering spiritual growth and transformation. Inspirational Quote by Jefferson Draw inspiration from an uplifting quote by Jefferson O. Inby, designed to motivate you and uplift you above life's challenges. Let us pray. Engage in prayer aligned with the day's subtitle, inviting God's presence and guidance into your life as you journey through the devotion. Make a difference by giving. Learn how you can support our work in this section. Your contributions can significantly impact someone's life. A final thought with Jefferson. Receive an encouraging message from Jefferson O. Inby. The day series concludes with a powerful motivational message that inspires you to embark on your week with renewed determination and purpose. The Affirmation The affirmation for this week's sure word for today. I am strengthened by my vulnerability, for in sharing, I find both courage and healing. The title for the series of the sure word for today. The title for this series of the sure word for today's daily audio devotion is The Strength in Sharing. Embracing vulnerability, the strength in sharing highlights the power of opening up about mental health struggles. In a world where silence often deepens our pain, Sharing our burdens invites healing and the love of God into our lives. Vulnerability is not weakness, it is the strength that allows others to support us. The Bible reminds us to bear one another's burdens, and in doing so, we fulfill God's law of love. Do not face your battles alone, reach out, speak up, and let both God and those around you help guide you towards healing. The subtitle for today's series. The subtitle for today's episode of the Sure Word for today's daily audio and video devotion is The Strength in Sharing. Part 3. The Key Bible Verse. Today's Bible verse of the sure word for today's audio and video daily devotion is taken from the book of 2 Corinthians, chapter 12, reading verse 19. Quote, But he said unto me, My grace is sufficient for thee, for my strength is made perfect in weakness. Unquote. Unless otherwise stated, we read all Bible quotations from the Holy Bible and the King James Version. The sure word for today's devotion. Mental health struggles often remain hidden, making the journey from darkness to light one of significant vulnerability. When you choose to open up about your pain, 
you invite healing and support into your life. Just like David in the Psalms, who cried out to God in his moments of despair, your journey from anguish to peace can begin by acknowledging your struggles and trusting in God's care. Vulnerability is not a weakness but a path towards recovery. The story of Elijah serves as a powerful illustration. After a victorious moment against the prophets of Baal, he fell into a deep depression, overwhelmed by fear and isolation. Yet, in his darkest moment, Elijah opened up to God about his despair and was met with divine comfort and renewed purpose. In the same way, when you bring your mental struggles into the light, you can find strength, comfort and healing through faith and a supportive community. Acknowledging the journey from darkness to light is a testimony of God's transformative power. Vulnerability allows you to invite others into your healing process, creating a space for encouragement and support. The road to mental health recovery is not a lonely one. When you share your burdens, the load becomes lighter and God's grace sustains you every step of the way. Connect. When I've faced overwhelming moments of darkness, speaking out and asking for help lifted a burden I didn't know I was carrying. Vulnerability isn't a sign of weakness, but the first step towards strength and healing. Extend. Psalm 34 verse 17 says, quote, The righteous cry, and the Lord hear it, and deliver them out of all their troubles, unquote. When you cry out, God listens and delivers you from your darkest struggles, leading you into the light of his peace. Reflection and Application Are you hiding any struggles that need to be brought into the light? Think about how opening up about your journey can lead to healing, both for you and for others around you. Inspirational quote by Jefferson Owen B. Quote, True healing begins when you embrace your vulnerability, allowing your journey from darkness to light to inspire both your growth and others' transformation. Unquote. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, I come before you with my hidden struggles and burdens. I ask for the strength to open up, to let your light shine through the darkness in my heart. Just as Elijah found comfort in your presence, I pray that you comfort and heal me through my journey. Let me be a light to others, sharing my testimony of transformation and healing through vulnerability. Guide me, sustain me, and remind me that your grace is sufficient for all I face. In Jesus' name, Amen. Make a difference by giving. Thank you for being a part of our community across the Shore Word for today. Start here with Jefferson and Robust Digital Expert. Your support is invaluable to us. By buying us a virtual coffee, you're helping us continue to produce content that inspires, educates, and empowers, 
making a difference in the lives of others. Together, we can make a difference and reach even more people. Thank you for your generosity and for believing in our mission. Make a difference today by clicking the link in the description. A final thought with Jefferson. What will you do when encouragement feels like a burden? Are you tired of hearing the exact phrases, God is turning things around for you? Everything will work out. This too shall pass. Weeping may endure for the night, but joy comes in the morning. I understand how exhausting it can feel. You are in pain, overwhelmed and frustrated. You've heard these words before and yet your situation has not improved. It feels like these words have lost their meaning. They are just empty promises. Hearing that God is working in your favor might feel like a burden right now. And I get that. But here is the truth. The part that is hard to hear. Just because you don't feel it doesn't mean it's not happening. God is working even when it's not apparent to you. This isn't just a line to make you feel better. It's the truth. I'm not here to please you or tell you what you want to hear. I'm here to speak the truth even if it stinks because it is the truth that will set you free. These words may not feel comforting now, but one day you will understand their value. This storm you are facing is temporary and it will pass. You may feel frustrated today, but there will come a day when you will look back and be grateful that you were reminded of the truth. Trust in the Lord even when it's hard. He will turn things around in your favor. Look forward to my new upcoming series in our new playlist, Mental Health Conditions. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, The Sure Word for Today, and click the notification bell to be alerted when the new series premieres. Stay tuned.